This is the customer entrance. There's another door at the other end, but that, that goes basically to the backstage area if you're in. So, come in. Anyhow, it, the, the whole idea is we have a drawing once a week for an iPod Touch with, with all of our apps on it. The, so they, they sign in for that, but it, it allows us to remain in contact with them. And it, that is crucial to, to what we're doing with this. We really are we're trying to gather the, the, the names that we can, but we also are maintaining a program where we stay in touch with them. So this, this tells people what to expect in the trailer. We didn't catch it at the beginning, but typically we, we have uh, an educational piece that we do two times for the public, one time for the dealers early in the morning. Did you do this last year too, this part of it? No, we didn't. Okay. The, literally the thing that you're about to see with Richard was filmed last Friday. Right. I've heard about that. So you've got a media server on board here somewhere. Actually, we don't. No? The, we've got eight Apple TVs, and we use those yeah. instead. Hmm. Um, anyhow. Three things, four things we got out of the research. Uh, one of the things, that, and if you wander around, there's a fellow here visiting tonight named Stuart Abrams. He is a consumer research guy. Mm. Literally, I mean, the he helped us do research on the old trailer mm -hmm. um, to find out what people liked and what they didn't like. And the, the four things that we got out of that is people wanted a, a way that they could, could see how the lights actually worked. Mm -hmm. And the other trailer was too cramped to allow that. They wanted individual control on, on each piece of equipment. Um, we, we thought we were being clever two years ago when we had an iPhone app to control the stuff. But unfortunately, your hand covers most of it. Nobody could see what... Uh, you know, how, how the stuff was being controlled. And so it turns out people want the ability to be able to control the stuff themselves. And so we've done that. And that's that's one of the, that's what this talks about. Right. So, that there's an iPad everywhere to, to control each each podium. So anyhow, the, we have two components to, to our program that we talk to people about. There are two videos, one with Richard Pilbrow, one with various lighting designers. Each has a purpose in that it, it it is an educational piece, and it, it's it's almost purely educational. I, I didn't pay Richard to say why is great or any of that stuff. Right. The, he, he's talking about the fundamentals of lighting. Right. We'll show you that video. And then the second one is various lighting designers talking about the challenges that they face each day and also what they think the trends are. And so the, the third thing that we do as part of our educational piece, our educational portion, is... Um, we, we have a, a, a keynote or PowerPoint, as you guys would say, uh, that, that shows how the, the fundamentals of lighting and the, and the challenges that people face are addressed by our various products. Mm -hmm. And then after that, we, we take down the, the theater part of it and, and everybody can, uh, can work with the equipment individually. And it, it, in that case, or in, in that instance, they can, they can work with Dusty or Jim or, or Phil and if they want to go deep into the thing and find out all the bits and bytes, they can certainly do that. But it, the idea is they get to drive. The trailer has air conditioning and heating, and it's there's a 40 kilowatt generator on the front of it, so it's completely self-contained. So you got six Samsung. Uh, what are these about? The 40 inch. 36. 36 inch. Seven. 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 Kind of back there. These are uh, LCDs. Yes. And each one of them is run by an Apple TV. And the, the concept of this is each podium is sitting next to a TV that shows what the product or product family will do in real life. Gotcha. And so this this is, is uh, Coloram, and this movie should represent people that have used Coloram in the past. River Dance, for instance, and turn it on. Anyhow, so, so the, the whole idea is each one of these podiums holds a, a, an example of a product family. Mm -hmm. Now, in almost everything that we make, we make multiple sizes of it. And so, the, while we couldn't bring all the stuff and, and still fit people in here, the whole idea is the, you, you've got an example of, of one of the product family and then you've got complete literature on the rest of it. 
And once we get caught up, there will be a video catalog of each each member of the family. It's going to be one of the guys that so that good overview though. So anyhow, that's the way this this is the uh, the all skate portion that I as I call it. This is where people can, can play with all these things themselves. Mm -hmm. the, the iPad allows you to control each thing. Oh, uh, Dusty, where are you? Thank you. So we use a program called Luminaire that is uh, really useful. Mm -hmm. ah, there you go. Mm -hmm. And so we now hopefully... Ten seconds. I've got to wait ten seconds. Oh, there you go. All right, so we, so we have control of the dimmer. Uh, mm -hmm. We can move the gel string. And the, these are two features that the fan speed most everybody knows about. You can control the fan speed remotely. Mm -hmm. But this is this is a feature that almost nobody knows about. And, and an actual TTD. TTD. Time to destination. Uh. So for instance, you, you can set this, and, and this is not marked, but every two or three percent is a different number of seconds. Mm -hmm. So you can say, I want to take 10 seconds to get to wherever the thing is supposed to move to, and you can do a bump cue, and the thing will move nice and slowly and smoothly, mm. and you can't do that with a lighting board because you've only got eight bits of, of resolution. Mm -hmm. And on a, on a string that's uh, 20 frames, that means you, each move is about an inch. And so each time, even if the lighting board is not dealing in percentage and is, is putting out the, the hexadecimal numbers, the it's the, the gel changer is still going to move an inch, mm -hmm. whereas with this, it allows you to move nice and slowly. And you can't do that with a lighting board. 